Hello, the Brew Crew, another Football Manager fan test, and welcome to uh, the fourth episode of uh, uh, my war crew here with Bologna. And today we meet Inter. It's going to be interesting. Uh, Inter have actually started the league pretty good, 16 points there. And we have started okay, I would say. Um, yeah, we played Cruz tone recently uh, finally we actually won a match against Kiev away 4-0 here we dominated the game why can't I see no I don't want to record highlights why can't I just hate how the interface is here or hate it sounds harsh but it was easier to show highlights before Yes, I don't know. Some of the hit hit the my here, then we counter, I believe. Why? Why? It's like no, you can't. You can't either because it, it's could scroll here. Sao has done it pretty good though. Where did their scores up? Oh. What's this? Why is problem with CPU now? I'm just going to show. Uh, Verdi was very good in this match Sapari um, yeah I can't remember I think this might have been one of these matches can you stop doing that uh, or no no it was the uh, Sampdoria match and the uh, Juventus match here I played them but it just uh, decided to get a crash dump or whatever so I had to play this all over to you Again, a great goal here, though, by Federico De Francesco, uh, player of the match. A really important victory here, actually, for us. Uh, we counter-attack here, I believe. Which, I guess, have worked the best so far. So, De Francesco, it's uh, Palat Palacio here. Uh, gets the ball back to... Uh, De Francesco and 2 0 there, and then we did decent match here in, uh, on Allianz Arena, which is called now not Juventus Stadium or Allianz Stadium. I mean, um, and we did a decent game, unfortunately. Um, uh, yeah, still Juventus was the better team, but Palacio at least scored a goal. He's He's been better now, and I don't know if I was starting per se, but Verdi, Nagy, Sao, and Palacio there. Great goal by Palacio. And then I had just, it, it was a while between. I wanted some uh, some better morale, but unfortunately, <laughs> we still couldn't win against Lecchio. So that was not perfect, but as you can see, it could have been worse. Uh, Palacio is a little bit pissed off, did he? I mean, he has got more chances though recently, as you could see there, and scoring goals. Uh, this play he will probably not get. I'm trying to sell him, but no one has shown interest so far. I'm, uh, yeah, we are 15 in the league, so about expected here. Spal, uh, Sampdoria has. Which is uh, Sampdoria is doing great in real life, so I believe it's like the 13, or I guess we could see, yeah, it, it might be something like that. 13 uh, matches in, and last year is doing way worse. Benvenuto is a little bit surprising on the 13th place there. Um, this is interesting, <laughs> I guess the uh, game is as well as. Uh, Real life suggesting that Milan will struggle. Crotone sixth. Don't know how that is possible. They did a great match against us recently. So, uh, Mirante in goal, uh, Emil Kraft, Giancarlo Gonzalez, and Sebastian Di Maio. That's basically our ordinary. Uh, what is it called? central or the two defensive central that played together they, they've been the best so far Messina 
Naji uh, Don uh, Donsai is this one of the better non Oregas Gonzalez has also been good. Gonzalez I saw now was a little bit tired, so maybe you should switch. Di Francesco is starting to play better. Uh, Verde, I believe, was uh, injured, started, and then Palacio and Sao. I'm going to try to keep this episode a little bit shorter than the Traveler was, or I will, I will, up, I will actually upload one episode. I have two episodes left. I were, I have a Europa League match left. I don't know, and I might just say it here even. Um, I'm thinking of doing that as a Twitch same, so feel free to say if you want to see that. Uh, I haven't decided if I, I, it would be cool if it is interested for that, but I'm not sure. Philip Hellander, how did he do recently? Who is the best sent? Okay, he's the. He's actually um, up the ranks here or whatever. I, it's a little bit worrying since, yeah, Gabarini, he's been a, basically a flop. And actually, to be fair, he costs pretty much for being 35. He costs almost 400,000, so I feel like almost a mistake. Are you fucking kidding with me? Can you stop doing that? I mean, what? I have nothing else than football manager, but he just hope oh, football manager can't play that. Um, no, I might need to delete some content or whatever because I almost have a full desk, but it's still not full. So I don't. It's weird. Anyone want my ticket? I can't make the time. Seriously, Veronica, getting stuck as Hester said. Come away when the victor. Really, who, who the freaks just decide? No, I don't. I don't want to see Bologna at all. Or is it because they don't think that we will do it? I'll play counter-attacking style today. A little bit surprising, but or surprise. It's not surprising. I mean, a little bit. Yeah, it's going to be tough. <laughs> to play uh, uh, control, so yeah. And let's see, I did make a switch, maybe now Gonzalez is still tired, so I think Helander has been surprisingly good, so he might actually be one choice here. Okay, that's his best position. Yeah, I will just continue with this because I feel like Sao has worked pretty good as a false nine. Donsai as Masala and Naji as a deep lying playmaker on defend. Uh, both this as uh, what to call it. Or is. Oh, he is best as a wing. I guess we are going to play him as a wing. And Palazzi is best as an inside forward. So. Yeah, and still I haven't downloaded the face pack. I might do that later. I just want to record because I believe is, is it no the week after next week I'm going to have a home exam or whatever we will probably uh, or is this in 3D I might yes yeah, sideline I like that this is going to be tough I'm I'm happy with just one point here to be fair is too much to ask for to really win this game. And especially since Inter has started the season so good, so yeah. Well, we had the first shot, or no, they had the first shot. I saw the wrong. Uh, oh, De Francesco, Helander, <laughs> Helander with the assist, great there, great choice to start him off. Then uh, I was thinking that uh, Bologna had caused problem for Inter before, but I'm not. I'm not super sure. He's he's great uh, set piece taker actually very did there, but I actually realized there was Calgary when uh, Swedish player Albin Ekdal played uh, at Calgary. So yeah. Oh. Oh. 
That was a little bit scary. I also thought he was looking offside there, so I don't know. I think it's not too long between the game seed or between the spell game there later on. I mean, why are he go getting so easily in there? Okay, DiMaggio is 31, but still, it shouldn't be that easy. We would just defend good. Man, I don't understand why I get to see that time I assist. Seem for others. Well, oh, I forgot to say that. I will, or was it? I don't know if it was. <laughs> if I recorded that. Or if it was last episode or whatever. I did make some substitution and they did not work. So I think it was a bug or something. <sighs> so far so good though. I mean they have not... How many? Three shot. It's pretty, pretty even still. I thought that Inter would be better, you know. Oh, so we saw Petkovic, he was injured, so I guess we get Petkovic in here. But we change his, he is better as target man support, so we will do that. I have done this change, why does it, it... Oh, there. It's just confusing all this. They've changed the interface so much, so it's so freaking confusing. I mean... I'm nothing against the uh, changing the interface and such, but just don't make it totally different than the other. How <laughs> football manager looks before is just confusing to make so many changes at once. Helander and Kraft were both Swedish players to play the best today. Verdi, not so much. It's a little bit difficult for him. But oh, yeah, here comes a counter or a corner again. It might be how we win this match, Di Francesco. Oh, good there, Kraft, Messina, Dosai. They are not ready here. Oh, that's poor, Palacio. You should do better there. Candreva. I guess I will see as well which match I will play next step. I might actually uh, play through some more matches. Let's see. Also, I don't want to take a match like that Juventus match. Ooh. Uh, which I uh, just fought on before. I, we never going to win that because it was a way as well. So, yeah. This, they are creating more chances, but so far so good. Or I don't know. A defensively. We have been a little bit lucky to be fair. Pissed off. I'm just saying <laughs> that it's not necessarily that we have been the best team here. 6.5. The Sai, Palacio. I'm a little bit disappointed by Palacio, but I'm not sure that we have another winger to get in here. Fortunately. Oh, we have him. Let's... No, why doesn't that work? There we go. We change that. Di Francesco will play the winger there. Oh, no. Okay, he can't play there either. Why can't he play? Oh, no. There we go. But they both have to play as wingers. Okay. To be fair, not that impressed with their offensive plays. Forty Carrot they would be, especially since everyone talking about how good he is. I thought they would do more here. And I guess we uh, defend good, and Mirant has been good in goal as well, saving some. But still, I thought they would 
I'm probably <laughs> probably going to get punished by saying that. Uh, 40 would create more clear cut chances. I don't know. I guess we could see the statistic after a while. We can't do it. No, you can't see that, right? You can't see where the clear cut chances is and such. Okay, here is the chance for Inter. And I still I don't know where I go to. It's just so confusing. I want sometimes to go on opponents just to change if they get some um, really good player in that I can mark him or such. But I don't know where the button is. It's just super confusing this. Messina, Mirante, Keresh, I don't know what it's called, Petkovic, uh. Di Maio, good there, lumped up, Petkovic, can he do something now, Icardi, Kandreva, oh, you are a little bit behind there. And he is good at running. And we have a draw right now. Uh, well, who was it? Was it me? I, what's the problem? Is it was bad up. Petko is as well. They shouldn't have just let the ball go to someone else there. Someone nearby him. Uh, I think we're going to take Tidear in, a former Inter player, which is a little bit funny, but oh well. And we're going to push free in the midfield here to win some more Inter or win some more tackles and such. Where do I? Oh, it's just so. I don't know if it's just me, but it's too way freaking confusing. Actually, I think I'm just going to play this match. I thought I was, but it's, it's going to be so long elsewhere, and I don't want it to be super long. No! I would hate to <laughs> concede the goal here at the end. Man, but I can't really. Oh, I can't really find where the opponent instructions are and such. I know I can find them in the beginning of the match, but not now or whatever. Uh, good there. Good ball winning. I try there. Petkovic is good here in the now to have. He can hold up the ball. That is awful. That is awful goalkeeping. They just said, oh, that's a great save. No, it's awful to... I mean, he did not have to say save that, to be fair. Kirich... Donsai. Di Francesco, can you make a good cross here in? Petkovic, ooh, it's an interception by Miranda, it was... I believe. Concentrate. Miranda. Messina. If we, uh, even if we would get a goal against us here, we still done a great game. Oh, Massina, not Messina. <laughs> I think I said wrong. Don't say. Petkovic, a lot of uh, space here, I would say, but unfortunately we lose the ball there. Naji wins the ball, though. Naji has really impressed me. A young Hungarian there. Gialdini. Oh, just be on par here now. Oh, good there. Mirante is very stable in goal. I mean, I'm, I'm not disappointed on this because they were third before this. They have a pretty good team as well, so fortunately we did let Kandreva there. He's such he, he's such a good uh, 
box to box midfielder or whatever. Or I don't know, he might be winger as well, I can't remember. Really, but he's good and he's really good at running and great, some great pace. So I think it works. I'm not I'm not super happy or I don't like Inter too much, so to say, since I'm a Milan fan, but I think he works perfectly, so that's actually great signing by Inter. So, oh great, three to four weeks. Well, I'm going to rest the boys. We could, I'm probably going to do then that match and maybe the, or yeah, we have some easier games here, so maybe Genoa. Probably, yeah, yeah, we're probably going to do the both uh, Genoa games. Sampdoria away there, and then Genoa at home. They have started really good there. It's, oh yeah, it's Ballardini. They have not started good in real life, but oh well. Thank you all for watching. Have a good tea and a good coffee day, and I see you soon again, so bye!